top. Now I'm gonna do up and down. Start off with dioxazine purple. I'm just gonna do a squiggly from the top. Straight down. And then back up because I need the paint to be kind of thick because I want there to be a decent amount of bloom on both sides. And then this color right here. Well, I shouldn't have told you the colors that we're going to be using. Dioxazine purple. I call it Puffy's pink. It's rose pink. My grandmother's nickname was Puffy, and I just her favorite color was coral. So I'm using a, a pink that looks kind of corally. A light blue violet. Silver for the shimmer. And I do have a coral right here. I'm just deciding if I'm going to add it or not. So let's see what happens here. No idea how this is going to work because I've really never worked with... Uh, a color base like this before that wasn't black or white i'm using the, um, all the paints here i usually use um artist loft for my um like my base paint is usually artist loft and some of these are artist loft some of these are um fao some of these are um dick Vick brand so there's tons and tons of different paints here so we shall see what happens Pretty color. I love it. And I'm gonna go down with the light blue violet. Say so all, all these colors go together. I'm gonna do some silver now. Because I want that puffy pink, as I call it, to show through just a tiny bit more. Because the color you do on top is the color that it's going to come, you know, you're going to see the most. Okay. I think we're good there. I think that's enough paint. Now let's try it. She loves it. I hope my mother loves this. Okay, so she was right. That pink is really beautiful. I'm glad I added all of that. I have a tendency to kind of not know where exactly I'm going with it, but I'm going to fidget with it. Basically, when I say fidget, blow it around with my mouth until I get um, a couple more wispies and blooms. But as you can see, that the base paint here really held up. It is gorgeous. There's no waste here. I barely have to clean a thing, which makes thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And like I said, if you want to purchase a piece, Want me to make you a piece uh, please contact me i will leave all my information below but i will show you all the other paints when i'm done and i'll show you this once i'm finished i'm just gonna fidget with it for a moment thanks for watching okay so this is the leftover color piece here absolutely beautiful i love it this was a little bit thicker the base was a little bit thicker than what i was used to using so it resulted in a blowout that really there's not a whole lot of color that came through the base paint didn't really pop through the way that i thought it was going to it looks beautiful absolutely beautiful